Hello everybody, it's Silver Shroom, and welcome back to more Poke Part 2 Wonders Beyond. In the last episode, we arrived in Cove Town, confronted Croc Rock and Sand Isle, and learned how to return to Wish Park. In this episode, we're going to do exactly that. And I meant to check the friends list in between episodes, but I'm pretty sure we have befriended everyone that we can so far. I was barely paying attention to the Pokemon themselves in that list, but whatever. So, we'll just head back to Seasong Beach, open the portal right up, and save some lives. Okay, hop down here. So I believe we've already befriended Petalil. And, and Fracture. Okay. I'll go ahead and bang my head into this tree for more berries. And make a stink berry that's gonna make them upset. No! Oh, that's too bad. Oh, whatever. So go ahead and hop down on this side. Says he made a good friend. And Sandow's over here. You, f you can find Croc Rock on the other side of the beach. It's Oshwat. Hey there, boss. Yeah, this is what you get for up and take people to Wish Park. You are fooled so easily. Yeah, that'll teach him. Uh, big beach ball. And now without further ado, the Wish Park Portal. Let's open the portal and save Piplup and the others. To open this portal, you must combine your own power with the power of all your friends. Would you like to give it a try? Yes. Now, I do personally like this mechanic. Like I said, it gives you an incentive to find friends. And... It's kind of great to see them all in one place. See all your friends running over. And now you just gotta shake the weir boat. Uh, LMMOs floating in midair back there. <laughs> Got 15 seconds, keep shaking. You can keep doing it even after the bar is filled. Which is all you need to do. And friendship power, 18,720. Yeah, with a lot of friends, you can make that number really high. But all that matters right now is that we can head back into Wish Park. My, how did you manage to open the portal by yourselves? Well, never mind. I'm sure I know why you came back. You can get it off of Kafagrikus's delicious cake. What? What's wrong? Why are you making such scary faces? Give everyone back? That is a wish I can't grant. If you insist, then I must run. That's cute, right? So, there are a few more hypnotized Pokemon here. We've got a Pelipper. I ate a lot. I'm so happy. Yeah, this guy's the evolved form of those Wingle. Watch out. This cake tastes so wonderful. 
Chinchino. I can't get enough of this. Munchlax. Cake. Yay, cake! Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's fine. He's acting normal. Pants here. This is all I need. Espion. Tee hee, I'm happy. Panpour. I want to be here forever. I wish Pan Sage were here too. And Drift Blim. What fun. So, everyone under the spell, let's go confront Kafagrigus and his Yamask. Wish Park is a great place. I won't let you go. Yeah, they're all gonna say the same thing. You, coming here on your own, you truly are fools. What? Return everyone to normal? We fear that is impossible, even with our awesome power. Only the Wish Bell has the power to announce the end of playtime. However, why would he tell us that? We shall not let anyone get close to that bell and end this merry time. If you would, wish the, if you would ring the Wish Bell, you must clear our attraction. You must face the improved cake contraption. Yeah, so it's back to the evil attractions. One thing people don't like about this game is that... Oh, well, they added a new part. Or just a bunch of cake. Is that you can't choose from all your friends to play the attractions. It's only the playable characters. So I'll go ahead and use Oshwat for this one. And he's using his scout trap as a pillow. I doubt that would be very comfortable. Okay, just so press A. And now there's a target score of 30,000. The first part is just the same as before. Shoot the Patrat and Watchog. Or, I guess, the nuts they're carrying. I don't believe I've ever missed a Watchog on this game. I'm pretty sure I just jinxed myself. Okay. I am a master at this game. Okay, I'm done. Oh no, I didn't make the target score. There's a second part. So just shoot once that they drop, and again to frost it, and make a strawberry appear out of nowhere. I guess the frosting appears out of nowhere too, so... What exactly are they shooting? The There's nothing coming out of Oshawa's scope there, so... How is he doing any of this? And you hear Pokemon coming, they'll be carrying some golden sponge cake. And... We passed 30,000 a long time ago. Vanillite. We won't be seeing that Pokemon in the main game for a while. Okay. Pretty sure I've missed like one cake so far. And Cottony will actually be seeing that one pretty soon. Okay, I've missed quite a few. Ah, great. 63,700. More than twice the target score. Okay, that's done. You 
cannot play Kate Contraption with other players. So that clearing an attraction that unlocks the ability to do it multiplayer. Gosh, what's sleeping on a scout chop again? How could it be? How did you conquer the improved Kate Contraption? Very well, the real battle begins now. We shall never let you approach the wish bell. We shall not let it ring. He's got the, that royal plural, whatever they call it. Still saying the same things. Now I'm actually going to switch to Pikachu. And uh, leave of them as an real advantage or disadvantage over a ghost type. I'll just, I'm just giving Pikachu this one. We said we wouldn't let you approach it. My Yamask, stop them. And fighting time. <laughs> Destroy Cofagrigus's cake. So just a little mini battle like just before the real battle starts. Just use your dash combos and iron tail. I wouldn't really recommend using Thunderbolt because it's kind of slow. And with the Yamask attacking you, you'll want to be able to move. And that was easy in just 17 seconds. Vermin ruining our lovely cake. Very well, if it's come to this, we shall deal with it ourselves. Come, our duel shall commence. Beat Cofagrigus. It's time to take on this attraction, boss. Ah, oh, it's got the shadow bulk. Trading blows. Let him show off a little attack there. Ah. Uh, I don't think that's double slap. I don't think Cofagricus can actually learn double slap. Uh, but I'll also crawl along the ground and just try to ram you. And voila! He is down! Okay, so some of these attraction bosses will get a little harder. But not by much, really. How could we have lost? Oh, master, the cake zone is finished! Okay. Alright, if we ring the bell, everyone will go back to normal. Dash to the wish bell to make it ring. And you know what? It's Oshawott's area. I think he should at least have the honor of ringing the wish bell. Yeah, boom! That's gotta hurt. Ah, everyone's back to normal. <laughs> we returned everyone from the cove area to normal, but I didn't see Piplup anywhere. Hey, Kafa Grigus, where did you hide Piplup? Piplup? Oh, the tottering little blue guy. He may have wandered into another zone. Ha ha ha. Looks like you have a question. This wish park is beyond your imagination. Our utopia has four zones, plus Wish Palace, the master's dwelling. The cake zone's bell has been rung true, but that is not sufficient to open the path to Wish Palace. You must first defeat the three remaining attractions. You shall never make it there. You've said too much, Kafagrigus. 
And it's Gothita's evolved form, Gotharita. Hmm. You're the troublemakers Gothita was talking about? The Covarious Pokemon were taken away from us, but... Pokemon from all over Poke Park are gathering here at Wish Park. We will make sure every Pokemon is captivated by Wish Park. We will create a world where the good times never end. That is our master's plan, and I won't let anyone interfere. Uh, they can just teleport wherever. Because why not? Oh, they're gone. Four zones in Wish Palace. Who could their master be? Let's go back to Samurott for now. So, uh, I actually think I'm going to do that in the next episode. Next time on Poke Park 2 Wonders Beyond, we're going to leave Wish Park and tell Samurott of our current situation. See you then.